Coming into indoors, you weren't really necessarily expecting quite as big of breakthroughs as you had. So now, how do you think about things differently? Like, wow, I, I went from coming into this, maybe trying to win a, an NCAA title to like, dang, I could maybe make the Olympic team and medal at the Olympics. Like, how has your perspective changed on that? For me, perspectives changed a lot. Definitely in the past six months, um, like I think my times show just like a really big jump, uh, clearly, especially from an outsider, just seeing it. And that's something that I think this team is perfect for. Um, just there's a, everyone, a good chunk of our like varsity team is looking to run after college and a good chunk of them are looking to run in the Olympics someday. And I think like having that around you just immediately puts you in a better mindset. I mean, like just going to practice every day and like you, you don't really realize, but like if you look at the people you're around like charlie's a 145 guy we have two 350 guys we have like five we probably have like six or seven sub four guys just like on the on the track at one time doing some reps like it's it's pretty insane to just kind of show up at practice and have that just be your normal day yeah. so i mean you know the more i look at it the more i feel like i'm in the best spot possible you to you know have those opportunities and then make that next step like it was kind of a no-brainer for that next step to happen just based on you know the environment we're in training in hayward um i mean every everything like that uh and and ben's phenomenal coach he knows what he's doing he's he's been pumping out awesome athletes for you know years now so um it's kind of only a matter of time that everyone is kind of getting in sync and hitting their stride and, um yeah just every day like seeing the same guys at practice like racing Cole every day, not racing, but like training with Cole every day at practice. Like, I mean, it doesn't get much better than that knowing that, you know, I feel like we're both at the top of our game right now and every workout, you know, we push each other to be better and better. So, um, yeah, I mean, just the environment around us, you know, it's hard not to be successful if you're really bought into it. How, how many people from your team will be back next year eligibility wise for like out of your out of your dmr teams that you had both the the record setting team and then slightly different team at the at the championships who who all is returning who all has eligibility left i think technically everybody i don't know necessarily like who's going to come back like i know charlie's sort of on the fence i'm sort of on the fence um i think reed will be back i don't know about cole he can speak for himself but uh Luis will be back and then, um, well, James didn't race it this year, but he was on last year's team. And I don't know, he doesn't have any more eligibility. He has outdoor left uh, this year. But so, yeah, like the majority of people will have the option to come back and whether they take it, who knows? Yeah. What, what do you think, Cole? Going pro? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I don't know. Really, that's, that's what's crazy, too, about your team is that it, anyone, it, it, it is weighing options of, you know, you all could go pro, probably. I would assume that. You've maybe had some discussions or will have brands reaching out, especially going into an Olympic cycle. So, uh, yeah, I mean, if you're if you're able to give us any any signals there, wouldn't be wouldn't be opposed to hearing about it. <laughs> yeah, you know, I would if I had any idea, honestly, and I'm not just saying that like, yeah, I've really not given it too much thought. Um, it's definitely something I'm interested. Obviously, that's like the goal. Um, it just came a little sooner than I was anticipating, honestly, like going into college. So yeah, I don't know, but it is crazy that I think, yeah, our whole DMR could come back, which I guess, I don't think it's super likely, but yeah, it just shows the depth. I think, uh, I think it's, will end up being sort of an all or nothing, like either, you know, a big chunk of us will leave or we'll kind of decide hey let's do one more year let's go win a triple crown yeah. like the last just do, like, you know do it um so that's that's what i think might happen i know charlie's sort of in the same boat i think you know you only get to be in college once so um it'd be cool to have that that experience and you know having one team national title uh under our belts now feels pretty good so and just knowing we'd have the depth we have some good guys coming in next year it could be fun but um, yeah, I guess you kind of got to take it step by step and see what the spring brings.